today we are going to discuss about randomized algorithms randomized algorithms are those algorithm that uses randomness as part of their logic with using such random number or randomness in the logic the output of a randomized algorithm can differ from each run with the same input there are various applications of randomized algorithms ranging from crypt cryptography and simulation to optimization problems the advantage of using randomness in algorithm is that it allows for the probabilistic approaches to problems that may otherwise be very difficult to solve it also provides a way to solve problems with high degree of accuracy while still being relatively efficient there are various types of randomized algorithm a uh, few of them are monte carlo algorithms and las vegas algorithm a monte carlo algorithms are a type of randomized algorithm that are used to solve problems by using random sampling here is an example to monte carlo algorithm uh, let's say that we want to calculate the value of pi one way to do this is to use a monte carlo algorithm so draw a square on a piece of paper and inscribe a circle within the square randomly generate points within the square by using a random number generator count the number of points that fall inside the circle and the number of points that fall outside the circle calculate the ratio of the number of points inside the circle to the total number of points generated multiply the ratio by 4 to estimate the value of pi pi now las vegas algorithm is a randomized algorithm that always gives the correct answer but its running time is a random variable the algorithm terminates with a correct solution after the finite number of steps and the expected running time is finite but the actual running time is a random variable this means that in some cases the algorithm may run much faster or much slower than it is expected running time so here is an example for las vegas algorithm uh, find a specific number in a large set of numbers a las vegas algorithm would randomly pick a number from the list and check if it's a correct one if it is not it would pick another number and check again so this process will continue until the correct number is found the common example for randomized algorithm is a quick sort algorithm uh, you would have studied this in your earlier semesters that which uses a randomization to choose a pivot element in order to avoid the worst case scenarios so these are the limitations of randomized algorithms uh, we know that Uh, randomized algorithms are not deterministic and produce different result each time they run so this itself is a limitation of randomized algorithm that it produces different outputs each time it is running so in conclusion randomized algorithm offer, offer a powerful tool for solving complex problems by incorporating randomness into their logic they are widely used in numerous fields and have a variety of applications that's all for today thank you